This is David Goldberg from Gold Street TV. I'm here with... Trinidad Garcia with Unanimous Boxing Gym. So Trinidad, talk about your background. Man, I started boxing at the age of seven years old. I had over 137 amateur fights. Um, on top of that, I ended up turning pro at the age of 21. Went till I was 26, had some injuries that had nothing to do with boxing. Came back at 30 years old, fought till I was 33. Retired, and then a year and a half after that, I opened up Unanimous Boxing Logan looks, Square. Your face looks pretty. So yeah, I, I, did you just not get I, didn't take, I didn't take as much punishment as most people do. you talk do. really well, so. Yeah, I like to think so, at least, right? Did you and run so, around the ring? What, no, 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 no. You just no. didn't get hit, you were I'm, fast. I was a Mexican fighter. I, I just tried <laughs> to end you before you ended me. And that was kind of the best way we ended up doing it. But uh, we opened up Logan Square in 2016. And then recently with Gold Street, we end up striking a deal here at uh, Unanimous Boxing West Loop. And your landlord, and, Sterling Bay. And our they were a great landlord to have. They were awesome. They get a, yeah. great, a very beneficial deal. Yep, they yeah, we, they, uh, they did us right, to say the least, to say the least. Our, our memberships vary. It all depends on what you're gonna do. We have something for people that only wanna come once or twice a week. We have something for people that are gonna come four or five times a week. People that are gonna come in and take unlimited classes and on top of boxing, we also offer strength and conditioning. So as you walk in, in, in from the, the main door, we come here. This is the unanimous pro shop. The goal is, within the next year to year and a half, I want to open up with my own brick and mortar. There is not a pro shop in the whole entire Midwest with the reliable Everlast. It's still, surprisingly enough, they've been around since, what, 1910, and, these, and they always leave and come back in and out of style. Nowadays, as we move on, when I was boxing, and oh God, it wasn't even that long ago, but if you go back to when I was an amateur, there was no strength and conditioning. Boxers didn't touch weights. It was a but thing. now that's changed. Now that's completely different. So now we have our strength, strength and conditioning. You just don't get the boxing aspect. Maybe you're not a boxing person. So people maybe, can just maybe come just in here want to come in and work out. out. The right way to do it. So our bagger, there's not an excuse why anybody should not get a bag. We have over 24 bags in the gym. There's zero reason why anybody should not get a bag here. We're gonna make sure you guys work. Our goal is that when you leave here, you're gonna go home and knock out like a baby. But in a sense for the everyday, the everyday person, our goal is to teach a real boxer without getting hit. Yeah. So learning how to slip a punch, learning, learning how to do that, and parrying a punch, doing that, without necessarily going through that whole entire thing. Gentlemen, I do have to let go, you go. I have go. too many people that are hey, on me. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, you guys. You were amazing. Yeah, I appreciate you it. You were great. You were great. Thank you. Oh, no, thank you guys.